um, game that I'm really looking forward to and brings on to that whole community lines I was talking about yesterday it's Borderlands now for those of you that don't know what that game is it's been in development for years now um, it's similar in sort of stylings as um, a Fallout 3 but sort of crossed with Mad Max you got like vehicle bits into it it's that whole sort of po post apocalyptic look to it um, the draw for me with that game is the fact that it's going to be four player co-op and it's that whole drop in drop out whenever you want and obviously you keep your experience and everything you've earned it'd be lovely I know Mick, a good friend of mine in real life I know he's definitely going to be picking it up um, I've heard a couple of other people mention that they're going to be getting it that I talk to on a semi-regular basis what I'd like if anyone out there is planning on getting that game or is into the whole co-op thing but doesn't know what game to get um, if that game does get obviously good reviews I'll be reviewing it myself as well if anyone's interested in getting involved need someone that they or just a friendly face someone that they've seen and they'd like to get involved then by all means give me a shout whether it be on here or on Xbox Live my game attack's pretty obvious anyway let me know I'll be more than happy to come in and jump in play a while with you play the whole bloody game with you I don't mind it's a case of that's the type of gaming that I love so I'll be more than happy as long as I don't get flooded with like few thousand bloody requests of oh yeah come and play Borderlands with us obviously within reason I'll be more than happy to get involved with everybody out there that wants to play that game um, moving on to November I'm a big big fan of Bioware for anyone that's seen the um, E3 videos you'll know exactly what I'm talking about one game that does interest me and I know it's another EA game uh, the fact that Bioware is going back to the whole sort of Baldur's Gate roots um, with Dragon Age Origins now I know the main focus when it comes to Bioware at the moment is all on Mass Effect 2 but from what I've seen of Dragon Age Origins it does look like it's going to be a brilliant RPG I'm hoping again I haven't heard anything so I'm not holding out much hope uh, that there's going to be some sort of co-op element in that I'd love again as with Borderlands if anyone if it is co-op which I'll try and find out as soon as possible if anyone does want to play obviously give me a shout again the one that when it was announced caused loads of co uh, controversy over E3 uh, Left 4 Dead 2 now controversial or not I want that game There's no doubt about it I love the whole sort of concept of uh, the original the fact that it was going back to that whole sort of Quake Unreal tournament style where it's just focusing on the multiplayer no pathetic single story uh, single player story and what have you just the whole focus on the fact of it being a multiplayer experience and again anyone out there that wants to play a few rounds or whatever by all means add me give me a shout or whatever and the other one which I'm looking forward to but I'm annoyed in the same respect with the fact that the way the pricing's going uh, Modern Warfare 2 now Activision I'm not going to throw all blame on Activision because at the end of the day they're not the only company that are doing things like that and I've heard people bashing Activision for the fact of them cutting them adding more money onto the actual retail price of their games and then praising EA for the fact of the way that they do things now I'm sorry if you're going to be talking about companies basically ripping off their customers you cannot and I mean that absolutely you cannot praise EA for giving the customers what they want they've got some of the worst customer services I've ever had to deal with I mean come on this is a company that try to charge people for guns in bad company and what have you they don't give a crap they're just as bad as Activision but they're more sort of uh, stealthy with the way that they bring in their charges and like I say it'd be nice to know exactly what everyone out there is looking forward to um, I know you've obviously got games like um, 
Rock Band Beatles, uh, Guitar Hero 5, I know DJ Hero comes out soon as well. If there's anything in particular that you're interested in, then by, please by all means leave a comment, do a video, let me know exactly what it is that will let me and everybody else in the community know what you're looking forward to. It'd be nice to get a little bit of discussion going and I'm hoping in a way, especially when it comes to responses from people that play on 360, the more responses that come up, it's a case of the more I can gauge certain things that I'm working on, which I'll get onto in the next video, and sort of tailor make certain things. So there's going to be a little touch in what I'm actually doing that's going to separate it from other sites out there. But like I say, I'll get onto that that aspect of things more in the future but I'll explain exactly what it is that I'm setting up in the next video.